And the economy is the main focus of the G20 summit, the event drawing to a close in Mexico. And while there have been hours of serious uh, and productive talks, a lot of work needs to be done to strengthen the global economy and grow jobs here at home. 13 ABC Washington Bureau Chief Jacqueline Policastro traveling with the president in Los Cabos. The clock is ticking as world leaders here at the G20 summit try to find those precious minutes to get together for one-on-one -on -one meetings. They were all smiles Monday as they took the traditional group photo, but behind those smiles were real concerns about the direction of the global economy, particularly in Europe. President Obama was hoping to meet with European leaders last night, but that Eurozone meeting was canceled after the G20 working dinner ran past its allotted time. There is still a lot of buzz about the one-on-one -on -one meeting Monday between Mr. Obama and Russian leader Vladimir Putin. The White House called it a constructive conversation. While both men don't see eye to eye on everything, just talking is important. Right now, the president is meeting with Chinese President Hu. That session, which was a late addition to his summit schedule, follows two group sessions this morning and a working lunch. Tonight, President Obama will take questions from the world media who are here. We'll be in that crowd and we'll have the story for you. Traveling with the president at the G20 Summit in Los Cabos, Mexico, I'm Jacqueline Policastro.